This isn't your typical diesel car. This green VW Bug runs on what is known as biodiesel. Biodiesel is a fuel made from biologically oil, most commonly soybean oil. Guilford-based Greenleaf Biodiesel is now distributing the fuel to customers across Connecticut. We're growing pretty quickly right now just as a distribution company, but really what we want to do is build a biodiesel plant in Connecticut, hopefully in New Haven area. Greenleaf, this is Gus. Gus Kellogg, Guilford native and founder of Greenleaf Biodiesel, believes the future is in sustainable and clean energy sources and that biodiesel is another weapon to combat climate change. The biggest uh, gain we're making in terms of emissions reduction is in CO2. So CO2, as we all know, is the leading greenhouse gas. Uh, a gallon of biodiesel reduces CO2 by up to 78 percent. Biodiesel can run in any diesel engine without modifications. Kellogg's company provides consumers the tool they need to make their cars green. We started distributing 18 months ago. Uh, we're now up to 100 customers using pure biodiesel. We have about another two to 300 customers using biodiesel blends. One biofuel drawback is that you cannot use it when temperatures fall below freezing. However, during our long New England winters, biofuel can actually be used to heat your home. You can use more biodiesel in a vehicle in the summer months, but then in the winter when you're heating your home, uh, biodiesel can be blended with home heating oil to reduce emissions from your home heating systems. Though the cost of a gallon of biofuel is comparable to a gallon of gas, it is 10 or 20 cents more expensive than a gallon of diesel. Either way, the savings for the environment are endless. If you'd like to learn more about biofuels or have a Going Green story idea of your own, visit our website, NBC30.com, and click on Going Green. Ryan Hanrahan, NBC30 News.